embraced um, what it takes in order to be a good player. He's, a, he's an extremely hard worker. Uh, he's, he's never afraid to come into the gym or the weight room. And as a coach, that's, that's, that's good for me to see and good for me to know. Yeah, I've been in the gym getting up a lot of shots, uh, a lot of ball handling, watching a lot of film. I'm really just fine-tuning all of the, the things in my game that I feel I need to improve on so we can take it to the next level and hopefully get a championship. He's embraced uh, some of the things that have come from, from me as a head coach and his, uh, the things that we needed him to get better at. And I definitely have no doubt that he's going to do those things and, and become the player we think um, is inside him. Again, anytime you're not afraid to come in the gym and put the work in, you're going to have a chance for the things to turn out the way you want them to turn out. I definitely want to we want to get 20 wins this season. Uh, we want to have a better finish in the uh, standings in the regular season and hopefully make a run during the tournament. But, um, you know, all that is going gonna, is gonna to start right now. So we really have to put it in the groundwork so we can achieve those goals that we, we've set for. When you're the point guard, and you're automatically one of the leaders of the team. And I think that he found out this past year of an adjustment that was going to be on his part as far as being coming off of all – rookie of the year type season and, and winning that award and then coming back his sophomore year and understanding that the bullseye was on his, directly on his back. And his numbers improved. We thought his shooting numbers would improve. Um, but he understands now for, the, for this upcoming year that he'll have to he'll have to be much more efficient, not only shooting the basketball, but just from a playmaker aspect, um, playing the point guard position. Really starting to notice things about my teammates' games, um, where they like to have the ball when they're about to shoot, uh, you know, positioning-wise, what things I think they need to work on or what coach thinks he needs to work on so I can reiterate those things when I'm on the court. Um, you know, encouraging, also making sure that everybody's getting better when we do do our workouts and when we're playing pickup and things like that. You know, just being an overall leader and making sure everybody's really developing and, and building our chemistry. He's an alpha male for us. Um, he's, made some, he's small in stature um, somewhat, but he understands – that he is in the forefront of our program, and I think that he has embraced some of the things that we've needed him to do, as well as as far as trying to be a better leader, um, being able to distribute the ball and find guys on time, um, and then being an overall um, just being comfortable in the fact that he is a leader and he needs to um, show his leadership in way in the ways that he's comfortable doing it. With the schedule that we had, especially the out-of-conference schedule, we're very excited to play against those top teams. You know, this is, this is what we signed up for. We want to compete and compete at the highest level. And um, playing against those teams that are going to be ranked in the top 25 is going to do a really good job of preparing us for our conference schedule. So we're very excited to, to go against those guys and, and see what we can do against them. He, again, is an extremely, extremely hard worker. He loves to play. Uh, he's passionate about the game of basketball, and as a as a former player in college, and as a head coach now, and played a position as point guard, that is somebody that I want controlling the basketball for our team. Um, I see the league as being up in the air when you have when you have two draft picks that uh, that just got drafted. The league the league is now more wide open uh, with BU and Loyola coming in. They have really good teams, so uh, it's going to be good competition playing against them, but I definitely think we have a shot in competing for the title this year. So um, we're confident in the work that we're putting in and the, the roster that we have, so we're going to be confident going into the into the regular, into the the conference play. This upcoming year and hopefully going to a senior year as well, um, we'll be able to see the, just the player that we know Justin can be, and I know he's looking forward to to uh, to coming out this year and, and, and doing some really good things for Holy Cross. And I'm just excited that he's my point guard. I think that he's going to definitely – uh, we, we feel really good with him in the driver's seat, and, and that's exactly where he is as a point guard for us.